What's going on ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Jimothy. Now if you're anything like me, you are missing the physical game of Yu-Gi-Oh! Playing on these online tournaments is all good and gravy, however the physical guard card game is where it is at ladies and gents and I'm itching to get back into some Yu-Gi-Oh! and actually use my decks. However, if you're also anything like me, you have been following the online tournaments that have been taking place, most notably the Yu-Gi-Oh! tournament, um, as well as the Pro Play Tour Games tournament, as well as CMOS tournament that he's hosting on his channel. Um, so, the reason why I wanted to do this video, ladies and gents, which is a little bit different, is I wanted to just have a little bit of a discussion as where you think the Yu-Gi-Oh! card game is at at the moment. Now, I've profiled a number of um, decks on my channel um, and the common theme that seems to be going around is you're missing evenly match, you're missing Dark Ruler no more, you're missing um, these meta cards, so to speak. And uh, the reason why I say this is because I've been following the online tournaments and I've seen some of the boards that um, Adamancipators have been building uh, most, most notably and their boards are just absolutely crazy, full of just a million and one negations. Now I'm not saying that my rogue deck should be as competitive as that Adamantipator deck but what I am saying is that it takes these huge blowout type cards for, for example, you're evenly matched your Dark Ruler no more, your Nibiru, even though that's to a lesser extent at the moment. It takes these huge blowout cards in order for you to be able to actually play the game of Yu-Gi-Oh! Um, and the reason why I say this is because I don't want Yu-Gi-Oh! to just turn into this whoever goes first wins type, break my board, start play, or I'm not letting you play Yu-Gi-Oh! kind of thing. Um, I want it to be a bit more of a... Uh, back and forth interaction so to speak not necessarily 16 million turns but just at least a couple of turns where it's a little bit more back and forth in my opinion um, I do like the fact that you can you're able if you're competent enough to be able to make these types of combos and be able to do these crazy lines of play but I do think that uh, the way that the game is evolving at the moment cards are just getting more and more powerful and the style of gameplay that is promoting is these big either I negate you or you negate me and whoever gets the most out of their negates wins kind of thing. It's not so much a navigation of okay I'm going to play this card in this position or I'm going to play this card now uh, and see where it takes me the next turn because most of the time you don't really get a next turn. Very very rare, rare you see a, a Yu-Gi-Oh game going into 10 plus turns for example. Now, I'm not saying that's the right way to play Yu-Gi-Oh! I'm just saying what do you think? What's your comment on it? What's your view on it ladies and gents? And it was just a little thing that I had in my head that I thought you know what let me just present this to you guys and see what you guys think. Um, I don't mind it at the moment but I don't, want, I don't want the game to evolve to a state where it's just that whoever goes first wins kind of thing. Now I know you can win going second and I know there are some cards that enable you to do that but my point is are these cards are these cards archetype specific or are these cards a more generic based um, you evenly match your dark ruler no more for example I know I've named those a couple of times but they are <laughs> some of the most powerful cards in being able to d deal with these 1 million negate boards so ladies and gents just a quick video today just thought I'd get my thoughts out there what do you think though let me know in the comment section below and we find ourselves at the end of another video as always if you do like this content be sure to like share subscribe and I would definitely definitely see you guys on the next video hope you enjoyed peace